Today was the last day of a ban on slaughtering live poultry in traditional markets, imposed on February 15th after outbreaks of the H5N6 strain of avian flu across Taiwan. There have been rumors that the ban would be extended, but the government has decided to let it expire after a group of experts concluded that the outbreaks were under control. So far, there have been no cases of humans contracting the virus. After a group of experts met to assess the current seven-day ban on the transport and slaughter of poultry, the government decided not to extend it. The ban on the transport and slaughter of poultry runs until tonight at midnight. We will stick to the original plan. The ban will end at midnight. During their meeting this afternoon, the experts noted that no new cases of the H5N6 strain of the virus have been reported since the ban took effect on February 15th. Because the virus has an incubation period of seven days, they concluded the outbreak is now under control. The focus now will be controlling wild birds. We will also strengthen observation mechanisms in wetlands or habitats where wild or resident birds are likely to be found. In one traditional market, vendors selling chicken, duck and geese have all stayed closed for several days. And one of their idle stands was even used by the pork vendor next door. There was only one vendor left selling roast chicken and duck who was using frozen fowl to make ends meet. But business still wasn't as good as usual. It's not surprising that people are worried. I normally sell 30 birds a day, but right now I'm not even selling 20. The Council of Agriculture said that even though the ban is ending, other preventive measures will still be carried out. Until the end of May, for example, ducks will have to test negative for disease before they can be slaughtered and sold on the market.